luxury liveaboard that's even greater than the sum of its five star parts. Impossible? Not if it's the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2. The images just simply do not do it justice. Breathtaking walls, lush coral gardens complete with every shape and color nature could dream up. The pulse of a healthy reef all around you. Deep blue as far as the eye can see. Is it as good as it seems? No, it's even better. But here's the thing, it isn't as good as it gets until you've done it from the ultimate liveaboard in the region. To dive the best, you need to board the best. From Northwest Point to French Key, from the flybridge to the sun deck to the air-conditioned salon, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2 has everything you need to get the most out of your time spent here. My name is Jason Henthorn. Uh, I live in Tampa, Florida, and uh, just decided to take a week on the uh, Turks and Caicos Explore to do some good diving. I'm Amber McCrocklin. I'm also from Tampa, and this is just an amazing boat, and it's just been wonderful. My name is Kara Livy. I'm from Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. We really like the Turks and Caicos Explore too, because as a liveaboard, um, it, it's meets all of our needs. We get to do a lot of diving, so if you want to do a lot of diving, we do five dives a day. It was great. Um, we'd come up from the dive, they'd feed us, take care of every, every need we could imagine, and then we'd go back in and dive again. So it's really, really nice in terms of you get a lot of what you want to do, which is diving and somewhat relaxing, and yet every time you come up you get fed and you're taken care of. Anyone who's done it will tell you again and again, the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2 is a truly special boat. But what is it that makes it so incredible? Maybe it comes from the gentle nature of these dive sites and the way we go about exploring them. We had some novices on the boat as well as we had some expert divers and so it was a nice combination and everybody seemed to enjoy it. I really enjoyed it. I think one of the things I like the best, this is my first live aboard, uh, I think the thing that I really like the, the best about it is, you know, everything's not on such a set tight schedule. Um, you know, get in the water, go down, you know, pick your buddy, and it's, it's not be back at the boat at, you know, an exact time. Kind of do your own thing and just very laissez-faire, um, very nice, very nice. Very nice, yeah, we both enjoyed it very much. Yeah. Maybe it's the fact that the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2 seems to always have these reefs and walls to itself. Ten air-conditioned double staterooms take a maximum of only 20 guests. So on any given day at any given dive site, you may find yourself feeling like the only group of divers in the ocean. And let me tell you, that's always a great sensation. Maybe it's the fact that the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2 has the best crew on the water. Let me tell you, these guys are among the best dive professionals you will ever encounter. Whether it's on board or in the water, there is never a point where you're not being watched over, looked after, or catered to. 
The best way to describe a guest aboard the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2? Every diver here is spoiled. Rotten. Spoiled rotten. <laughs> The crew are absolutely fabulous. These guys went out of their way to actually make you feel um, like part of the family. The dive masters are very skilled. They know what they're talking about. They lead us around. They show us all the great sights. I did a nitrox course on this on this liveaboard, this dive, and the instructor not only recognized I wanted to do the course, but also recognized it was my vacation. So let me go at my own pace. It was fabulous. The cook is amazing. The food has been incredible. Never have I gone hungry once, which has been a very good thing for me. And, um, it's good for everyone, actually. It's good for everybody. It's good for everyone. The food was fabulous. Stan, the cook, is absolutely awesome. Ten pounds. Twelve pounds. I came oh. here undernourished. More than anything, it's just like attention to detail, like all the little details, whether it was the food or us diving, and you know, we're not having to worry about anything, just whether we're going to go on this dive or not. It's really the only worries we had. So. They're there for me with what I need right away so that I don't waste any time and I'm out of the water. It's been very good. Or maybe, just maybe, it's the fact that nothing that swims or crawls here is particularly camera shy. The Turks and Caicos Islands are an image maker's dream, and with this cast of characters, it's not going to be hard. Whether it crawls or swims, whether it has gills or needs air to breathe, the close proximity you will keep with some of the ocean's most impressive species can easily turn an experience into an encounter. There's a lot of life, a lot of life on the reefs, There's some turtles, eagle rays, um, and then you know the smaller fish, tons of fish on the reef. The reefs are actually in really good shape, um, and, and even things like the sand, things that I never thought um, I'd, I'd find interest in, the, the, the life just in the sand itself was fascinating. If you ask me, I think it's everything. And that's what keeps the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2 faithful coming back. Absolutely. In a heartbeat, we would come back to the Turks and Caicos Explorer 2. It was a great experience, and we plan to do it again. You know, we've talked about that, and I think because of the size of the rooms and <clears throat> the, the staff, how wonderful the staff is, I think we would definitely do this again. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. absolutely. I've had a really good time. You know, a lot of bottom time, so I'm sure we'll be on this boat again sometime in the future. Number one, the crew is the best. 110, 120, 180 percent for the crew. The diving is awesome, the price is awesome, the whole boat, the whole package is the best. I wouldn't go with anybody else but Explore Ventures. All it takes is one trip, one experience, one encounter. Don't you think it's time you found out for yourself?
How's my hair? Oh, your hair's beautiful. <laughs> you look good.